All right, so what is going on YouTube? This is Sam Richie. Sam Richie here. Coming to you guys today, XO. Uh, today at 401 with Red Eyes Infernoid. So you swept everybody today, man. XO, yeah. XO. All right, so show us your amazing Red Eyes Infernoid deck profile. All right, it's a little bit different. So we three Infernoids. Uh, sorry, three Decatrons. Uh, you, don't, you don't need to explain them. Two Antros. Two Harmadicks. Not three Harmadicks? No, no, not three. Uh, too much in front of monsters clogs the deck. As weird as that sounds, I don't like the clogs. Uh, two Patrullias. Only two? Yeah, only two. Only two, okay. Wow. Um, two of this guy. Alright, so what is he? I have never used this effect once in my life. You just use him to make Decatron at level 7, so you can spam rank 7 plays all day. Alright, so this is what this deck is about, just spamming rank 7 spam plays. It's a, yeah, spamming the Red Eyes player. Alright, awesome. Uh, the best card in the deck, 3 uh, Saitamas. No explanation. I only run 2 uh, Tondel, just because again, I don't want to get foggy. And uh, one of each big guy. The awesome. Viadi and Nuku. So those are for the Infernoid monsters. And some text I have is a uh, two red eyes black fire dragon. All right, so why is this card so good in this deck? Uh, okay, no one, no one's gonna call seven on reasoning. He swings for forty eight when he attacks, so you could, and even if he doesn't do a direct attack, you just attack a monster. Your opponent still takes uh, twenty four damage. Wait, he swings for four, for what? For forty eight. If he get direct attack is forty eight. If he attacks a monster, he swings for twenty four. Wow. And he's a Gemini, so he doesn't count towards your level limit. Does he owe you anything? So if you have him on the field, you can still bring out two more in front of him. No. And then you can that make. Was my card. Uh, Yo. You can make a red eyes fire middle dragon and have him. So if he's destroyed, you just bring him back. Wow. So that's for the monsters. Wait, does he, for spells, does I play obviously three reasonings. Best card of the deck. Yeah. One monster gate. It's better than reasoning. I hope it goes back to. I hope it goes up. At least two. Two into the voids. I only play these because uh, these clog your hand. And into the void. If you can get these into the graveyard. You can just special summon them back to the field. So that's that's the main reason for into the void. Uh, two void seers. You don't really need three because they work in the graveyard, so it's like four. One for one. Uh, if you have this in Decatron first turn, you could pretty much make a rank seven play really quick. Just summon Decatron, ditch Sightsimus. Uh Sorry, ditch uh, the level six guy. Or sorry, ditch Sightsimus for one for one. Yeah. Summon Decatron. Decatron di ditch the level six guy. Bring back. Miss and then make a rank seven play. All right, so awesome. So you're gonna show us the combo after. Uh, yeah, after. I'll show you the combo after. And then just uh, burial, regeki, dark hall, foolish. Just in case if you don't open with uh, sight miss. Uh, chalice. In case someone tries to dark law your reasoning or something. Yeah. Uh, and silver cry. This card is just a quick play, just to just to reborn the red eyes if you're in a tough time. Yeah. That's it for the spells. For the traps, I just keep it simple. I play Vanities, Torrential, it's like the best trap. And three Mirror Force, in case you summon Decatron, and then they they Veiler you, and then you're stuck on a Decatron, and you just want to have some backup. Awesome, so triple Mirror Force, wow. Crazy. Yeah, that's for the traps. Now off to uh, your side deck real quick. For the side deck, yeah, it's all out of order, but... So I play Jinzo. Uh, hit him off Reasoning, doesn't really matter. Uh, Chaos Hunter, it's good against the Mirror Match, it's good against Necroz. And Ritual Beast. And Ritual Beast, and he's a rank 7. If you want to make rank 7 plays, go, go for it all day. Stygian and Dirge. Uh, Burning Abyss. Burning Abyss, yeah, it just fucks him. And uh, all the, the new clown shit, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't play any rank 3s at all. Uh, two uh, Light Imprisoning Mirrors for Teller Knights. Uh, two Shadow Imprisoning Mirrors for all the other dark stuff. Uh, two fairy wins for Iron Walls in game two and three. Two mistakes, Necroz and Klee. Two spell cancelers, Necroz and Klee. And uh, my tank injection fairy lily gets wow. over towers, and no one calls three off reasoning. Wow. That's crazy. And it pushes for a game. Okay, awesome. Now, can you show us your extra deck? Yeah. So. Uh, so, this is pretty much a two card extra deck, but. Wow. Make this all day. I'll show you the combo after. Yeah. <laughs> Two red eyes. This is like the only card I ever make. Like, scrap archery and I don't make them. This guy, sometimes. Spellgrand's so, alright. Big guy's pretty good. Never play him. Draco Sack. I don't even know why he's there. You could, 
Decatron and dump the rank nine, especially someone I know who are, I don't know, I've never played. Yeah. Yazi for BAs. This because I couldn't think of anything else and I couldn't think of anything else. Awesome, okay. Now uh, show us the combo that you were talking about. Yeah, okay, so. You, let's say you open with. Uh, okay, okay, so what are the requirements that you need for this crazy combo? Uh, Decatron in hand. So Decatron in hand? Sightsimus either in hand or grave. Okay. And, and, okay, so when you, you summon Decatron. Yeah, you summon Decatron. On okay. Decatron's effect, you dump the level 6 guy. So you dump this guy to the graveyard? Yeah. Okay. Uh, then you have Sightsimus either in grave or in hand, you special summon him. Okay, so you banish two Infernoids? Yeah. Okay. Go into the, the Red Eyes Flare Dragon. And then the point is, I try to get my. Um, where is it? My Red Eyes Flare Dragons. Yeah. So this is the main play. This is like a big board right here because they take 500 per card to activate, and he can't be destroyed by by card effects. So you can only bounce him or run him over by battle, which is really hard to do. Yeah. Uh, against like scout, they have to pay 500 to activate scout, and then they have to pay 500 to pay the 800. So it just it kills please, and it's good because if you have this in the grave, you could dump Sightsimus. Special summon this red eyes, and because he's a Gemini, you can bring Sightsimus back because he's a normal monster and it doesn't count towards the level limit. Yeah. I overlay these two for a second red eyes, so they just take a thousand for anything they do and they both can't be destroyed by battle. Wow, a thousand for every card they activate. That's yeah. crazy. Yeah. That's it's insane. It's pretty much a red eyes deck with an Inferno and engine. Like. <laughs> awesome, awesome. Yeah. Okay, all right, David, do you have anything else you want to say uh, um, that you might want to change the deck? Like, what you want to add, maybe? I might retire the deck soon. Oh. I want to build DDDs when they come out. They look sick. All right, awesome, awesome. All right, David, so uh, this is our amazing uh, Red Eyes Infernoid that just went XO today at Locals. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, give this video a thumbs up. And again, David, thank you so much for his deck profile. Peace out, guys.